This beautiful seven-year-old Karen Terrier is Bella. And Bella was relinquished by her family to Chicago Animal Control because she kept escaping from their yard and they were getting ticketed. So we were lucky enough to be able to acquire Bella and she has been absolutely delightful in foster care. Sue, what can you tell us about Bella? Bella's a really, really good girl. She gets along well with other dogs. Um, she's very well house trained. Um, she loves her humans. She loves belly rubs. And she has some favorite toys um, that she loves to play with. Uh, Bella is a great companion. Always uh, likes to be where her humans are. And she would make a great friend and a companion for someone who has lots of time to give her and lots of attention and love. So it sounds to me like Bella would probably enjoy a home where somebody was home for most of the day? She would, because she, uh, she likes to be around her humans. I mean, she does well on her own, but she's happiest when she's near her humans. And do you think, uh, would she be acceptable as an only dog, or do you she think she... would be acceptable okay. as an only dog. And I think it takes her a little while sometimes to warm up to other dogs, correct? Um, just a little bit. Uh -huh. I think mean, she's got a preliminary reaction, right, to introduction. But then she settles down and, and enjoys playing with other dogs. Awesome. And she is just a beautiful girl. And I should mention that Bella has got a docked tail. When we first acquired her, we thought that maybe she was a Norwich Terrier, but we consulted with several breeders who confirmed that, yes, she is indeed a Karen Terrier. Um, around the time Bella was born, uh, there was a, a Norfolk Terrier that was winning many dog shows, and as a result of that, we saw many backyard breeders actually docking Karen tails and trying to pass their Karens off as Norwiches or Norfolks, and we suspect that that's what happened in Bella's case. We do know that Bella was originally purchased at a pet shop in Chicago, and pet shops are notorious for getting their dogs from backyard breeders, so that certainly makes sense. Um, so that is Bella, and we look forward to finding her a wonderful forever home. Thanks, Bella.